President Sauter, the Union College community has chosen you and has affirmed their faith and trust in you by selecting you to be its 29th president. Dr. Sauter came to Union at the right time. Union was at a crossroads where it really needed to rediscover its identity and have a focus in a direction. She kept us focused on track, and I think we're gonna have a bright future because she pushed strategic planning. Someone who took Union exactly where it needed to go. Strategic planning. Strategic planning, strategic planning, strategic planning. She is focused on the vision, but she's also very interested on walking with you through the details. And I think to me, that's what makes a great leader. She is an engine for positive change on campus. We got more done in a year and a half than most small colleges do in five years. And she's one of the hardest working people I've ever been around. She went through hard times. Uh, Dr. Sauter was president of Union during possibly, arguably, one of the most difficult times in the college's history, and that is the COVID pandemic. The demands that were put on the staff were enormous. So it took away some of the special sauce, if you will, of Union College, and that is the student interaction. Now they had to be six feet apart. Now they had to be tested every time they turned around. Now they weren't able to, to play together and, and study together. But somehow through all of that, she brought a stability, a creativity, and a determination that got us through. She's really been the, the push behind getting our whole student success department, um, a cohesive department, and, and being there to help all of our freshmen be successful. The remodeling of the amphitheater. Uh, for years we taught with orange and yellow, uncomfortable, uh, near uh, catastrophic chairs for students has given students a unique learning space, but also it's a lot more fun to teach in. The largest campaign she has been involved with is definitely the $13 million renovation of existing uh, Larson Lifestyle Center and the 40,000 square foot addition. So she was responsible for helping us develop a brand. She was also responsible for leading the charge in creating a whole new name for the institution that did potentially the impossible. It helped us create a distinct identity um, amongst the Union Colleges out there and doubling down on who we are as an institution, as a Seventh-day Adventist Christian institution. Dr. Sauter's doors are always open. I mean, that kind of personal touch, that kind of roll your sleeves up and let's, let's dig into a problem, is something that I think is, is actually a hallmark of who she is as a leader. I would say she's a really good listener. There are students who come to her for financial advice or just life advice in general because when you have a problem, sometimes it helps to just go to the most authoritative person you know. She was the first one who started shipping Daniel and I, but we don't need to put that in the video. She was the one who told me, you should, you should ask him out. He's 100% interested in you. Things that I think will be part of her legacy, first female, president for Union College, I mean, that in and of itself is a legacy, and then 10 years that she served here. What I knew about Vanita is she loved Union College. She loved the faculty. She loved the students. She loved what Union College was all about.